from the New York area? Yes. Where, what county are you from? Suffolk County. Will your family be listening to your testimony here today? Yes. When did you enter the uh, police academy? January 26, 1982. Did you receive integrity training at the academy? Some, yes. What do you mean by some? We had visits from internal affairs officers. The life in the academy is, is sort of like going to a parochial school, if you look back at it. It was a, a building time, a time to build a camaraderie. With the, with the guy next to you, the guy, you know, whatever side of you, 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 be, you started to form a bond as a, as a unit. Did you personally treat it seriously, the integrity training? Uh, no. And based on your conversations with your other recruits, did they treat it seriously? No, uh, that's how we all formulated our own opinions from that. And based on what you could see, did the instructors treat it seriously? Not at all. I recall having internal affairs, giving a lesson to the class. And after the in individual left, the, our academy instructor looked at us and said, now, you can go that way or you can go this way. If you want to be a successful cop, you don't go that way. And this is the academy. I didn't even step on the street yet, and I'm being told, you know, side in this direction with whatever you got to do. Cover your ass. That was the biggest thing. You Cover your ass so that you don't have to deal with internal affairs. Mr. Dowd, in your experiences in your first year, did you come to learn what it meant for a police officer to be quote unquote good? Yes. Could you tell the commissioners and the public what it means to be good in the police jargon as you know it? Well, being good is a cop that would never give up another cop. A cop that if uh, he witnesses something go down, he's 100% be, he's behind anything a cop does, no matter what it is. It began to form a bond at that early stage. If you said blue, I said blue. You know, you said green, it was green. You know, I don't know, Johnny says it's green. I, I saw green. You, you don't, you didn't, you always took the side of the cop that was with you because he was the only one that was going to back you up when you needed help. Mr. Dowd, in a precinct like the 75th Precinct, did it become particularly necessary to forge bonds with other police officers there? Yes. Why was that? Survival. 